What's up guys, Econ5 Cat Cat here today. We're going to be doing another anus gear unboxing. Um, got my handy dandy knife. I've got a tripod now per popular demand. What I ordered was HK Army Epic Speed Feed. Alright, let's see here. Oh, they gave me stickers. Stickers! Let's paint polish that. Make sure you can see what I'm doing. Yes, you can. Alright, paint polish have an up scene. Session with stickers. Um, it was total, grand total is $27.95, 28 bucks. So, I'm pretty stoked about this, actually. The speed feed, um, because it's for my Prophecy. Let me grab it. And the problem with my Prophecy speed feed, can you see that? Let me check. Yeah. Um, I think it's an old GXG right here. It got shot right here, and now if you put any paint in it, all it takes is not much to just open it. It's been spilling paint all over the place, and plus... You know, here, let me actually just get a handful of paint. I'll just show you guys. You know, it does not go in at all. You know, that's what I've gotten nine paintballs to purchase, so. And they just don't. Like, if you drop them dead in, but if you drop them on the side, they'll perch very easily. So, there's that. So, oh, and this is Valkyrie Infinity paint. So. Alright, let's actually dig into the speed feed, because I'm pretty stoked about this, actually. And it comes in a nice little Ziploc bag. So that's kind of nice. It comes in a little Ziploc bag if you want to put your speed feed back in its bag, which I'm not quite sure why you do, but you can. Um, so it comes with a rain lid, which I think is very innovative and nice. Because... You know, if it's raining out and you don't want to have to... With the Prophecy, this isn't that big of a deal. It's still... It's going to be a little annoying. You know, you're going to have to... Um, oh, wow. That's really nice quality. It smells really weird. Bad, actually. It smells really bad. But here's the thing. I don't know why. It's just got this feeling that one of these fingers is going to rip. I might be wrong, though. I probably am. Because... But I don't know why. I just... It seems like if you were to bend this finger, but it doesn't go back, but it's a lot more flexible and better than the old GXG, so, yeah. Alright, I'm pretty stoked about this, and one of the magnets already fell out. whoop de doo Is it in there? Or did I just not get a magnet? See, that's where the magnets go. One of them has already managed to fall out. Um, so... Alright, I'm not too happy about that. Is it actually in here? If I, if I can reattach it, I really don't care. One way or another. If I can get a chance to reattach it. But if they just didn't give me the magnet, no, I'm not going to be too happy. Yeah, I didn't get a magnet. Alright, so that's one downer for the HK Army thing, is it's already missing a magnet. I'm a little upset about that, but it'll work. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and put it on the Prophecy, see how she looks. Very simple to put a speed feed on the Prophecy, just pull it aside and then, alright, we can throw that garbage out there. Let's put the speed feed on. I got it in red, because I like red. And it snaps on there very nicely. And, oh yeah, that's nice. That's really nice, actually. Uh, I have very high doubt. Here, let me actually grab a couple paint balls and we'll see just how easy it is to drop them in. I'll do an official review slash video on this later. I haven't played with it yet, so I have to put a couple of cases before into a product before I can do a review on it. Because this isn't PB reviewed. Yeah. Oh, perched. Went in. Perch. Went in. Went in. Went in. If I put it on the side, you can just barely get it perched. But if I like do this, it goes in. So. Oh, bounce. So let's see if we can get any pop. Now keep in mind, I don't have that much pain in here, but it does not seem like this lid will be popping open on me anytime soon. So I'm really happy about that. And plus, I can always just steal another magnet off of the um, old Halo stock lid. Because I don't use that, because I've got a um, other speed feed on it. But yeah, aside from the fact that it did not come with that, um, other thing, and it smells really bad, but that's not their fault. And, you know, it's got the rain cover on it, so 
That's really nice. I like the rank cover. Um, good job, HK. Props on that. I mean, is it going to be a little hard to play in the rain? But yeah, it's easier because I don't actually have a lift. I bought this hopper used from Scrooby Spirit 16. Shout out to you, dude. You're awesome. Um, hope to play with you again, man. That didn't sound right, but... Um, so yeah. I'll give you guys an official review on it later. But outside of the fact that it's missing the magnet, which I did not remove... Right there is where the other magnet's supposed to be. There's one magnet and there's another. Bad HA. So I'll actually look on my bed just to make sure and confirm that I'm not the one who lost it. That they did actually did not ship it to me with it. Because I don't want to be like having some dude looking at a video going, It's right there, you dead ass. Yeah, so. Alright. No, it's not there. So but it does not look like it's going to open up on me, like, at all, so. It looks like it exerts some serious force, which is unlike this, and you can actually see it better now. But I've also got another one of these coming on the way, just because it was like a dollar on me this year. So yeah, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe, check out other gameplay videos, close your knives after you do unboxing videos, and yeah, bye.